What's your biggest fear? Speaking in public? Snakes? Spiders? Maybe it's talking to friends and family members who are facing death. I mean, that's pretty scary, right? Do we even need to talk about it? There's a sense of needing to talk about this. But the interesting thing to me is how difficult and how seldom do we talk about my death? People are afraid to talk about death because of their own sense of their mortality. If I talk about it, it's a recognition that that is part of life. I'm Deborah Jarvis, and you're listening to The Final Say, the podcast where you can get comfortable talking about death and learn some things about living from people who are dying. I've spent the last 30 years as a hospital and hospice chaplain, and I'd walk out of these rooms thinking, everyone should have heard that conversation. Well, now you can listen in. And I'll be talking to the real experts, people who are facing death themselves. And we'll hear different views on death. How I think about death is how I think about life. You need to be able to inhabit whatever situation you're in, fully inhabit it. Doesn't mean you have to like it, but you have to be able to appreciate what it offers. I really value the closeness of um, what this sentence of death <laughs> has given me, is, is um, closeness to people. So join me as we talk about how to face death, which can help us understand how to face life. I'm Deborah Jarvis, and this is The Final Say. What's left that you would really like to do? I mean, besides, like, date George Clooney. 